Alright guys, welcome back to more Home and Away. Today we are going to be playing Wigan and Bolton, guys. This one was suggested a few months ago, but I've been sort of putting it off a little bit, you know, a bit later down the line, guys. It's one of those that you don't, when you when you think of rivalries, you don't think of this one first, dear. But it's it's one, it's one, guys. So today, yeah, <laughs> this one is going to be a, 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 an epic game, maybe. Um, and yeah that's about it guys you can't say any more than that i've got the legendary vaz tear playing because like nearly all well not all but like uh, quite a few of bolton's players are on uh blue arrows and i don't like blue arrows i get rid of the blue arrows blue arrows suck uh hunt was one of those who's uh starting because of a blue arrow as well and who else did i put on i think i put pedersen on as well and who was oh who was the other one Carter, Nak Nakata, <laughs> or whatever you want to call him, he he's a ledge. He is a ledge. So uh, today, um, the, the, you know, I I didn't really notice that this one was a rivalry, if I'm honest. And that's a goal. Oh my God, Vazzy has actually scored. Oh my, it's bringing back FIFA six flashbacks. But yeah, this one I, I never really. Yeah, wow, he's 19 back then, man. Seriously. Um, never really sort of, like, thought about it that much sort of thing. Not really a fixture that I'm particularly interested in. But, uh, yeah, we're at the uh, Wigan's JGB Stadium, as it was called back then, for this one. So, yeah, Pedersen shot, saved, and a Vezzi. It, it had to be a rebound, didn't it? It had to be a rebound for Vezzi. You know what I mean? Because... <laughs> if he scores anything else, guys. If he scores anything else, but um, yeah, kind of liking uh, th this series so far. Um, like, like, I, I mean, I've enjoyed it, but like now that we've we're sort of like changing on to PES five. I mean, whether or not this is PES, we can come back to PES six at any time, of course. But whether or not uh, we actually do that, uh, I don't know. I think it'd be nice to just change things up and use PES five for a bit. You know what I mean, guys? Like so. Yeah, but it's mostly probably just going to be between PES 5 and PES 6. You know what I mean? Maybe later down the line we, we can maybe go into different games or whatever. You know what I mean? FIFA could be a possibility at some point. But I want to keep it maybe just with PES for the time being. So, uh, yeah. And don't let him have that shot in. Ooh, blocked out. Go on. Oh, Vazzy is using the pace. He's using the pace. And that was the most terrible thing ever. A Koch is on there. He's a ledge. And picked up by Eskalan and Walker was on better form, backup keeper, but uh Eskalanen's gonna play instead. Because he's a ledge, he's a ledge. Very good keeper. There's McCulloch. Bullard. I think in the what was it? The mm, yeah, well, I was comparing like freaking like Sunderland to Wigan <laughs> in the other episode, wasn't I? Like um, when I was just saying that, you know how like like Wigan just used to stay up all the time. Um, the season they did go down though, they did win the FA Cup. Uh, I think it was against Man City in the final, if I'm not mistaken. And um, yeah, can't really consider it a bad season, I suppose, in that sense, <laughs> you know? I mean, it's bad that they've gone down, obviously, but s still an FA Cup win, you know? I mean, I think at the time they were saying, like, you know, like, um, you know, it, it's a bad thing that, that, that they've gone down, but, you know, the, the fans have got the memories of the FA Cup, and to be honest, w would you take an FA Cup win and get relegated, or would you just, you know, rather just stay in the league? I think, you know, most fans would take the FA Cup win because that's memories and you pretty much go down in history as a, as a cup winner, cup winning team. So, um, yeah, can't be bad at all. <laughs> and then, um, it's kind of strange because like, the following season, like, a hull went to the FA Cup final and then, um, but they, they stayed up, but obviously they lost the final. So it's, it's kind of kind of strange. They stayed in the league but lose the cup kind of thing, whereas Wigan won the cup but went down in the league kind of thing. So it's a little bit strange, but yeah. The thing is, though, is it, for me, a lot of the, um, like, the, you know, like the FA Cup, I don't know why we're talking about FA Cup, because this is, like, nothing to do with the FA Cup, this match, but, oh, crap. Um, like, you know, it, it's kind of like one of those things, like, they, they have nothing really to play for, 
like you know like the the teams that are like facing relegation and fighting don't really have much else to play for so it's like they give it a really good go in the cup competitions you know what i mean we've seen it down the years you know what i mean like i think like portsmouth um in 2010, you know, Wigan 2013, Aston Villa uh, 2015, Hull, uh, I mean, and Hull did, you know, stay up that year, but, like, you know, Hull um, 2014, um, you know I mean? Uh, not even that, but, like, even the Carling Cup, like, uh, uh, Carling Cup, uh, like, Sunderland, I think, was 2014 against Man City in the final. They stayed up, but still, it's like they don't have much else to play for, so it's like they give it a good go in the cup competitions that's what somebody said to me once now it's kind of strange isn't it when you when you put it that way and you think about all the the teams that have actually you know like done really well and gotten far in the fa cup or the carling cup and but then like gone on to sort of like struggle against relegation kind of thing but then again it shouldn't really have to come there. if they can put that much effort in in the cup then why can't they do it in the league kind of thing you know what i mean I mean, I guess the cup competition, you've got a good chance of getting far in it if you come up against sort of like the lower league teams. But um, I don't know. It's an interesting like concept kind of thing. But uh, yeah, here's Nakata or Nakata, whatever you want to call him. Oh, forced to save there. Oh, Vaztea was on side if we could get the header back to him, but we didn't. Here's Francis. Nolan. Gardner. Oh, that's good. Vazzy, uh, Pedersen, he's going to have to go wide. We get the free kick, though. Are we going to shoot on this? It looks like a good distance out. Uh, we'll give it a go. Straight into the wall, going to get the throw in. And, oh! I can't believe that. Vazzy had more time there. If he had taken it under control, he probably would have scored instead of just shooting first time. But still. Whipped into the box there. And... Oh! How did you miss that? I think it was going towards the top corner. It would have been a pretty good goal. But uh, still, that is half time, guys. Let's switch over to Wigan. So, here we go. Second half is off. Can we uh, get the equalising goal back? Possibly. Don't let Bazzy score against us, please. That would be nice. But, uh, yeah. Here he is there. Oh, Honcho picks it out. Jason Roberts. Camera. Uh, just go wide here. It's Francis. Good ball in, head it. Oh, didn't get the head there. Chimbonda, Bullard, Camera does a bit of a t ten kind of thing. That okay, just roll over in front of the man there. That's cool, you know. Last line of defence there or something. Nolan, Pedersen. And is mm, Roberts was running in, but he was a little bit. I think he was getting blocked out by some of their defenders, so it was a little bit tricky. Chimbonda and whipped in, mm, and 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 ah, oh, too much and. Doof's coming on for Pedersen. Yeah, Doof was one of those who was on a blue hour, so I didn't I didn't play him at the start. So uh, at least they're bringing on somebody who's gone a blue arrow, <laughs> you know. That's the thing in this game because I don't think there's actually a way to find out your opponent's, um, you know, like their their team's form, if you know what I mean. Unless, of course, like you you were playing an exhibition and you switch over player or something.
And here's Roberts. And... Ah. Oh. Yes. Oh, come on. That was looking good. Well, this is this has been a bit dull, hasn't it? Apart from that one goal, but that wasn't even an exciting goal. Jeez, it was just a reeb. <laughs> it was just a reeb. But you got to love the reebs. Plenty of reebs on this channel, guys. Roberts offside. Fucking hell. <laughs> just just when you think there's a little bit of excitement, guys. We we get brought down to F again. Look at that. That is bullshit F stuff. Come on, come on, gonna play it wide again, and Vast here is trying to get back to stop us, don't let him do stuff, please. Maybe should have played this match on PES 6, guys, <laughs> you know, maybe. What a great first season, though, Wigan had, though, when they, uh, when they went into the Prem in 2005, Jesus, man, they were really good, like, near Christmas time, I think they were, like, first or second or something like that. That was a close chance. It, uh, it went pretty well for him. And they went to the uh, the uh, Carling Cup final that same season. Kind of strange because West Ham went to the FA Cup final as well and they were promoted that season as well. So, pretty decent season for both of them teams, I guess. Of course, obviously they didn't win those finals, but you know. I think Wigan were destroyed 4-0 by United. <laughs> and Liverpool beat um, West Ham. Of course, though. It's, it's always like a, you know, it's, it's always a competitive season, though, isn't it, though? Like uh, the, the season before a World Cup, though, because obviously it was the World Cup in 2006. Obviously, it's... It, it should, you know, be competitive in the um, in the sense that you know players are fighting for a place at the World Cup. You know, obviously, if their team has qualified, um, which you know will be determined up to a certain point, but depending on you know the nation, of course. Is McCullough? And just gonna have to whip it in. There's nobody there, man. Oh, he's Chimbonda. Roberts. Oh, come on, go wide and lose the ball. Thank you. That's that's just lovely. It's just exactly what I wanted right there. Oh wow. Well. It, it, it was a match. It was a ma it was a rivalry. It was a match. There you go, guys. That that is all I have to say. A dull one, but still. Game records: Vast here, seven point oh. Got the winning goal. Showed a bit of good pace. I guess probably deserved it more than anyone. Akocha got a seven as well. Did he? No, I don't think he. No, the. Well, it was a rebound, wasn't it? So I was going to say, unless the pass... Did it come off him before? I don't know. Jesus. <laughs> Who knows? Who cares, guys? But there you go. That was uh, today's game. Uh, Polly only with a 5.0 there in goal for him. So not good. But yeah, please do comment, subscribe, and share as always, guys. Hopefully next time it isn't as bad. See you then.